brought to you London Boxing News from the capital city here with Lee Selby. Lee, you're deep in the training camp for your IBF world title fight of Vali Brnovic. Um, take us through your mindset and what you're putting into this camp as opposed to other fights. Um, well, first of all, I'm just fully fully focused on Evgeny Vladovich. I'm thinking about when I wake up, when I go to sleep, but he's just on my mind constantly. I've, I've been out to LA sparring, which I, which I do for most of my camps. I've been out there, LA sparring. I had two weeks out there. When I was out in America, we had, we had the call, letting us know the fight was going to be made the 30th. We, in my head, I, I had April 25th, so I just carried on with the sparring. When I got back, I had a, I had a nice, easy week, just, just relaxing, recovering from the sparring. And I got back back to work then. And just so in effect, that almost a month out where you had to basically a week off, yeah. that hasn't affected your peaking. And I, I didn't have a week off. I just took it a little bit easier. And just ticked over. But um, like I'm, uh, to be honest, I'm, I'm ready to fight now. If, if yeah. the fight was in two weeks' time, I'd be I'd be ready. I'd be happy, yeah. confident. The the standard and quality other fighters have told us um, that they receive when they go to America, yeah. you know, LA, you know, wherever it be in America, I'd say second to none and you just can't get that experience oh, unfortunately in the UK, is it that you see just, the level just better, better level, better level of fighters, just great experience, you can kind of buy that type of experience. I, I spied out there six times in, in two weeks, I spied the world amateur champion, a two-time Olympian, unbeaten pros, I had a range of all types of sparring, so I'm well prepared. Fantastic. And are they, are they without meaning um, to sound disrespectful, they're aware of your, your standing oh, yeah, out yeah. there, you know, you're yeah, on the verge of becoming like, a world champion. Because we, we, we visit the regular, like the trainers, they, they know us, so it's, it's, good for, it's good for them as well, as well as me, the sparring. Does, does Chris go out there with you? Yeah, Chris, Chris comes out, me and Chris. And Tamuka Mucho Ponda come from last time. He's an unbeaten while to wait, one of Chris's, Chris's boys. Yeah. He's bad as well, held, held his own with all, all types of fighters. So it's a great experience for us both. Fantastic. When, the, when, the, when the, all the training is said and done, all the press conferences are over, and you walk out that night, mm -hmm. are you in no uncertain terms what you're going to go in that ring and do? It's clear in your mind. Are you playing that out? I go for it. I go for it in my head almost every night when I'm laying in bed. Mm. Hopefully, hopefully it plays out how I've been seeing it and I become victorious. I last spoke to you, Lee, and you um, were saying, even in sparring, let alone a fight, you don't you don't feel like you can be beaten. You you just I, every fight has got that mindset, but yeah. even in sparring, you don't lose rounds. You don't, you and I'm, I'm really competitive. Whether if it's ever sparring, we're having a fight. Even, even when I'm like running on the street, if I see like a keep fitter down the road jogging, I, I gotta overtake him. <laughs> and, uh, that's, that's just how I am. I gotta win. And, like I'm running in the gym on the running machine. You see, it's like my last ten minutes on the running machine. Someone jumps on fresh. Like, I gotta see on there until they go off. Really? <laughs> yeah. You're so competitive. And as a young boy growing up in Wales, yeah. did you ever dream that you'd be um, joint co-headlining uh, such an event? To be honest, I did, yeah, but I think I was the only person, <laughs> none of my family or friends that would have fought it. Well, in the back of my head, I always thought I could, I could fight for the world title. Oh, fantastic, Lee. Well, thank you for talking to us, mate, thank and I wish you all the best. Nice thank you very much. You.